Welcome to my channel and thank you for taking the time to watch this video. I would also like to welcome Spirit into this reading and say thank you for the messages we are about to receive. This is a general reading. So the first card is the handshake. Uh, it looks like there's a new offer coming in there with a king of hearts uh, and you know it, you might be um, you know sealing a deal signing new contracts uh, you know this is about handshakes uh, you know finishing completing a contract or or you know um, reaching a closure really so this could be a new contract that comes in for you there's certainly news that is coming in for you some really good news of there and it's to do with money you've got the jack of hearts over there with that uh, um, rider so some new uh, news coming in about money and about a new job and it looks like it's a new offer that came in and it looks like you will be, uh, sh you know, shaking hands and, and sealing the deal there. Uh, there's uh, whatever problems you've been dealing with, it looks like security is coming in. This could be the key to a, uh, any kind of problems, but this could be a key to a new home because this is, you know, the four of rods, it's about stability, it's about home, it's about victory. Uh, so it could be that you could be even, uh, you know, buying a new home and moving on as well. Uh, so there's a lot of security coming in, but um, a lot of solution to problems that you've been going through. Now, in the past, you've got the lion, so you've had some really bad news recently, shocking news uh, that's caused a lot of problems, and it might have been to do with money as well. You've got that six of uh, diamonds over there, so this is about needing to, uh, you know, ask for a loan or ask somebody for financial assistance as well. So there wasn't, uh, you know, you've had some problems to do with money recently. Both these cards are to do with money. You've got even the four of uh, diamonds over there. So this is about hanging on to your finances and trying to sort things through. Maybe you've even asked somebody that's close to you, friend or family, uh, for some financial assistance over there with that uh, four of diamonds and the dog with it. Now going into the future, you've got uh, the seven of um um, clubs over here. This is about needing to defend yourself in any kind of difficult situation. So if uh, you know you're going to be facing some problems, it seems you need to sort it out one at a time, and maybe even get some advice from you know people around you, um, you know, um, female figures in your life. Really, uh, you might even be dealing with problems to do with females in your life. Uh, you know, family members. Uh, You've got a new job coming in, and you have been facing some financial problems as well, but a new job is coming in with that anchor card there. So you will be successful in acquiring a new job, uh, but you are going through some financial lack, loss over there. You are feeling the pinch over there. So there is a new job coming in, and it is going to bring you financial rewards. There will be issues that you will have to deal with, but you know, try to sort it out one at a time, and don't get overwhelmed by it. You will be able to sort things through. And there is some good news coming in about money and a new job over there with that rider card. Okay, so I'm just going to draw some cards from the uh, Tarot of the Sweet Twilight. The bottom of the deck, you've got the six of, six of wands. So there's been something surprising and shocking that's happened for you. Uh, and you've been very upset about whatever the issues are that you've been facing. So you've been going through a lot of problems, a lot of conflict. Um, and, you know, crying about it, really. But there's victory that is coming in for you. So you can see with that seven of pentacles, it might have been issues to do with the work situation. You might be even looking for a new job over there. And it's been very, very difficult. There's been a lot of conflict competition that you've had to face uh, before you can even acquire a new job but you will be victorious in it so although it's upsetting you quite a bit and you're putting yourself out there you are trying to focus on that coin with that queen of pentacles you can see there's lots of boxes over there uh, and you're very upset because you know maybe you feel like you're not making any headway at the moment or you're trying to get out of a situation um, but you feel like you know you, you're not able to sort through it because there's so much a competition to get a hold of a new job maybe and maybe this is upsetting you quite a bit at the moment so what's going on with you you've got the hermit card over here and the three of wands so you might need to take on some further study some further um training really to bring your uh skill set up um you know, get your skill set up to scratch, really, in order for you to acquire a new job. You can see trying to get to the top over there is very, very difficult. You can see there's a lots of pitfalls, there's a lot of obstacles, and there's a lot of people vying for the same position over here. And maybe to get for, you know, get the edge, 
you do need to go and do some further training with that hermit card. This is your card, and maybe this is what you do need to do. You need to go and uh, learn or do something further to upgrade your skills in order for you to beat the competition over there. Otherwise, it's just going to end up being really, really difficult for you to acquire what you are going after. You have been facing some kind of decision over there. It seems like there is some new offer that has come in for you over there uh, with that knave of pentacles. So some news has come in uh, about a new job. You were at a position where you're trying to make a decision uh, in the past few months. Uh, so you've been very confused about what to do, actually do. It seems like recently some kind of uh, job offer may have come in, but things are still up in the air over there. So you're not quite sure on how to actually proceed. And it might be that you do need to go and do some further training or learning or study uh, in order for you to get uh, you know, to make a decision and get something that's more stable. You've got the chariot card over here, so you're trying to move away from this old situation. You have been dealing with very toxic people over there. You're trying to take control. The chariot card, uh, you know, is ruled by cancer, and there might even be some issues that are going on on the home front as well that you're trying to get away from. Uh, but you are trying to make a decision to move forward, and you're hoping that things are going to be victorious for you there with that chariot card. You might be thinking of even traveling or leaving your country or wherever you're living at to go and start afresh somewhere else. Now, you've got the Nine of Wands. So you need to hang in there. Uh, you need to be very, very uh, determined. Stay determined, even though this is very, very tiring and you might feel like you are losing. Don't lose hope. Um, you're not losing the battle. Um, you need to just, uh, you know, be very, you know, it just needs a little extra strength, an excellent, a little extra determination, and make sure that you're communicating very, very clearly. So you need to stand your ground over there with that Nine of uh, Wands. You've got the King of Cups, so there is an, an offer coming in over there for you. If this is what you're waiting for, it looks like somebody is about to give you an offer over there with that King of Cups. So something is coming in. You just need to hang in there. You've got the Five of Cups over there, so you're very, very upset still about things. And stop looking at the past. Uh, you need to get out of that mode about feeling negative. Uh, you know, even though it seems very, very difficult right now, you do need to um, change your mindset in order for you to bring that positivity in. Things are about to end, so you want to end this uh, cycle of feeling depressed and miserable and upset. This is playing on your mind quite a bit. Uh, you know, maybe you are feeling very, very unsupported at, at this particular time, and you're hoping that this ends, all that changes right now. So going to the future and the final outcome, you've got the Knight of Wands, the Six of Swords, and the Magician. Now, it looks like you're going to have to move on, maybe probably uh, relocate you're going to another country uh, to do this particular job. With the Knight of Wands, it's about travel overseas. You can see these two people on a horse and they're flying with it. You're going to have to be very strategic in how you do things as well. Uh, and with that Knight of uh, Wands, it's usually about moving country and getting a new job somewhere else. Letting go of everything that has gone because things are a bit, you know... Uh, they're not very settled where you are at the moment, so you need to actually move on uh, to do this particular job. Then you've got uh, the Six of Swords over here, and this is another card about moving on, maybe signing a new contract somewhere else, letting uh, this situation go, because it's not serving you and it's not working out for you as well. There's a lot of conflict or there's a lot of problems wherever you are at, and uh, you know it's taking its toll on your health as well. So you do need to actually move on, and you can manifest it. You've got the a magician card. You are going to be very, very busy soon. You need to put out a lot more communication. You need to network a lot more with that magician card. It is your card in the sense that it's ruled by um, Mercury. And this is about international communication. This is about uh, networking. And you need to be very proactive. So it's not going to fall in your lap. You're going to be have to be the one that you know goes for it. You, you're going to have to be the one that manifests it yourself. And this is the only way you're going to be able to move out of the situation. And it actually might mean travel and moving on to another country to do that particular job that you're doing or even relocating to another place but really moving on so whatever problems you have you've got to face them in the sense that you've got to stand up for yourself but it also might mean that you have to think outside the box and uh, go and do that job somewhere else you know it, you have to and it might mean that you also may need to actually like I said do some further training uh, something that gets you, gives you the edge over everybody else. So this is the Angel Tarot, and this is for the Oracle read. 
and the first card is the page of fire and this is news coming in uh, about an exciting new endeavor use your originality and your ingenuity now this is international news coming in with that page of fire and this could be about a job offer from an international front and this is about maybe a message even coming from the international front for you so something new coming in some news coming in whatever you're dealing with you've got the uh, nine of fire here again so it says which is this nine of wands which says don't give up protect that which you have created uh, have courage and believe in yourself so you do have to hang in there you have to be very positive and not give up hope this is very very important for you and the two of water it looks like somebody's going to come in and help you out there so somebody giving you advice somebody giving you a helping hand uh, this could even be a new offer that comes in uh, maybe even working in a partnership with somebody over there so this is a positive resolution of any kind of conflict going on but also uh, with the two of water it could be a new offer that comes in for you that is going to be positive and it's going to be maybe even an offer from overseas as well with that two of water so I hope that this reading has resonated with you and I wish you all the best and thank you so much for watching. Take care. Goodbye.